What's going on everybody? This is Jeff. So today I'm going to answer a question from Commander Chief. What about Oahu? Is it safe to live there? So I'm going to go ahead and answer that question, but I'm also going to answer questions about all of the islands and give some opinion and give some information about the state. Is Oahu safe to live? Sure. I mean, what is, where are you living right now? Is it safer than where you're living? Probably. <laughs> I mean, there is a drug problem in Oahu. You know, that's a big deal. There's a lot of homeless there. Um, it, anytime you get big crowds, you know, you get the risk of pickpockets um, and just petty crimes and even crimes that you would see on Dog the Bounty Hunter. Dog the Bounty Hunter, that is in Oahu. If you want to know what kind of crimes go on, go tune in to Dog, the bounty hunter, see what he, see what he's up to. Now, um, have I had any incidents in Oahu? No. Personally, I mean, that's as a visitor. I haven't lived there. Do I know people who've had incidents in Oahu? No. So... I mean, that's the best way I can answer that question. It's a good question, and it's worth asking, especially with the way that, you know, people make things sound. I mean, I've heard all types of different scenarios of stories that have happened in Oahu. It's the biggest metropolitan area, you know. It's got like a mil over a million people on that island alone. That's more than the rest of the state. So, um, because a lot of people who watch these, this channel also want to know safest places in you know safest places in Hawaii um, this is what this is what's on the list uh, Kauai is one Molokai is two um, Oahu Chofield Barracks which is the military base Hanalei Kauai Kilauea Kauai Lapahoehoe on the Big Island, Haleiwa, Oahu, Mililani Town, Oahu. You know, I'm not seeing a lot of Maui on here. Now, of all the islands that I've been to, you know, I've been to all of them except for Lanai and Molokai, actually. I need to go there. But I would say I found Maui to be the overall safest. I thought Oahu was had the traffic was I thought the traffic situation was unstable in Oahu Maui has better traffic situ or better driving circumstances I thought the Big Island had a very very unique um, driving circumstances a lot of people pass you know there's a lot of people that pass away on the Big Island driving around that crazy island not too many motorcycle act or not too many accidents here on um Maui. I thought Kauai wasn't that friendly for drivers either, but I think Maui is. Just with all the factors included. Safety as far as driving goes, Maui. As far as just general safety walking around, I could see why people would say that they wouldn't want to go, that they wouldn't feel safe in Maui. I guess. I feel safe in Maui. I think Maui is actually really safe. I think it's the safest island of all. I think it's the safest. Despite what the internet says, I find Maui to be overall the safest. Between crime, traffic safety, uh, all sorts of different anomaly situations, natural disasters. I mean, if a natural disaster comes, uh, it's like a hurricane, for example. Big Island's going to take the brunt force of it and slow it down. So a hurricane getting over here, you know, it's got to go through the Big Island, really, even if it's because the path, even if Maui's farther north, the path is, it would have to be coming, you know, it, it, they, they don't come from the north to south because hurricanes don't, don't start in cold water. They start in warm water and work their way up. So it, that path, it would have to be coming, it would be affected by the big island. So as far as hurricanes go, I mean, you'll get a tropical storm. Flooding? Sure, Maui. But... Um, I already mentioned the traffic and as far as the crime goes, man, it might have been wild in the past, but Maui doesn't have much crime that I've seen. 
I mean, they have a few homeless people, nothing like uh, Kona, nothing like Hilo, nothing like uh, Oahu. I could see why they would say maybe Kauai is pretty safe, but uh, when it comes to just natural disasters, I mean, Kauai seems to be a little bit more <laughs> treacherous, but I could see why they would say that. I mean, more more things, people, you know, hikers come up missing in Kauai than they do anywhere else. Maybe the Big Island also, in like the Valley, YPO Valley. But, um, you know, as far as adventure activities, Maui's safe, safer than all the others. I mean, people fall off cliffs over in um, Oahu. Like I said, people get lost in the in the Nepali state, you know, in the Nepali coast. It washed out to sea at, you know, Queen's Bath. Big Island, you know. It's wild. Lava. It's, you know, active volcano. Um, that's why I just say, man, I mean, I'm sure Molokai is actually pretty safe, but then again, I've heard Molokai is not exactly safe um, for a whole, you know, because let's just say people like to keep Molokai low, low profile. And I've heard stories, whether people go mainstream with these stories is one thing, but I've heard crazy stories about, uh, you know, going out drinking in Molokai at a bar after hours. So that's, that's Molokai. I, I know it's safe overall, but if you're, you know, I wouldn't say going out drinking in bars and everything late at night in the local neighborhood is safe. It's kind of like, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't necessarily try to stay too many nights camping out in uh, Nalehu at uh, Whittington's Park or South Point. I wouldn't try to do that or uh, down there by um, Ho'okena. <laughs> I wouldn't, I wouldn't overstay my welcome down there. I mean, there's Hana, Hana's, you know. It's maybe a tough one to say that that's completely safe because, you know, at night, walking around Hana, probably not the safest, but Lahaina, Kihei, Wailuku, all safe in my opinion. That's my opinion. I put, I put Maui as the safest island. You know, I know a lot of you guys might go on the internet and see where it says Kauai, but between, between the driving and the wild weather and the wet weather and I would in the just crazy waves I would say Kauai maybe second to Maui in volume and everything so Big Island's pretty safe I mean I guess <laughs> and Oahu's just like any other city just like any other city but uh, let's see here. What, what are some other important factors that people look at when they're uh, trying to live here or move here? So the military, being close to a military base is usually pretty safe. Um, Kapolei, they're saying, is pretty safe on Oahu. If you're trying to move to Oahu, which is what... Um, the original question was about there's Kapolei there's uh, Mililani a, a town there's Haleiwa and Schofield Barracks so those are some of the safest towns uh, as far as people being being influenced by the internet my partner and I are hoping to take a six month break in Hawaii. We are unsure of crime rates in Hawaii. We would appreciate any opinions. We are looking for a relaxing, calm, and friendly place to stay, preferably close to the beach. Would not like to be too secluded though. At first we had planned to visit the island of Maui, but changed our minds after reading many reviews of crime incidents there. By the way, this is posted in 2008, so I, I don't know if it's changed. And then, um, but 
a reply to that would be, hi, I think you got it wrong about crime on Maui. Petty theft is everywhere, but crime, not so much. Oahu has the most crimes, it is, and it's still not dangerous. Um, if you want to stay near a beach for six months, I warn you, you're, it's going to cost a lot. On the big island, to be close to a beach, more than $200 a night, and, and a break on weekly, but still. Okay. Um, just seeing. And then here's another one. You needn't worry about crime on Maui. It's no better or worse than anywhere else in the United States. Maui fits everything you're looking for. Don't discount her needlessly. Thousands of visitors come each day and never have any problems. So this is people who are reading on the internet that Maui's got high crime. And locals and people who have been to Maui many times are saying, whoa, 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 where did you hear that? Maui or Oahu, the trick may be to find a place that is free for six months. Um, there is no more crime than in, in Hawaii. Maui has the most high-end travelers who flash and strut things about being easy targets, but crime still isn't an issue. The safest island is Lanai. There you go. I didn't even mention Lanai because it's very small. It's got a population of 3,500 people and very many people don't like to go there. Um, so I guess they're saying Lanai, but we, when we're talking big four, you know, Lanai rarely ever comes up. Then this person is saying they like Kauai. And I, I, I go back in time to uh, like 2008 to compare my opinion of how I perceive it now to how people back in 2008 perceived it. So overall, Hawaii it's in itself is a safe place, assuming you're not doing anything that you wouldn't normally do. If you're an adventure junkie, you know, hey, you're signing up for that. If you're uh, ignoring signs and doing things like climbing Stairway to Heaven or Crouching Lion on Oahu, or if you're going deep into the YPO Valley at night when it's raining, torrential rain, or in Hana when it's raining like crazy and flash floods could happen, or if it's super huge waves and you're walking along the cliff line, okay, that's different. That's you putting yourself in harm's way knowingly. But as far as like unwarranted or risk that you need to know about that, you know, just things happening out of the blue even when you're following all the rules, it's a pretty safe place. Pretty safe place. Outside of, you know, driving. Just drive. Try to put your phone down when you're driving. I know it's difficult, but try not to text and drive. It's a big thing. Because uh, it might not always be you. It could be um, someone who's out having a good time uh, crossing the center line. Or something stupid like that because they've had too many to drinks too many too many to drink so overall to answer the question yes Oahu is very safe to live it's safer than San Diego safer than Los Angeles I think I think it's safe so anyways guys thanks for watching subscribe to my channel if you like and we'll see you next time